Hey everyone, this is Charles Mitri from loungeboudoir.com and in this episode of Boudoir Pose Breakdown, we're going to take a look at the décolletage detail shot. Now, first of all, what is the décolletage? So décolletage is a French word meaning the exposed upper area of the chest on a woman. Um, it can include the neck, bare shoulders, parts of the cleavage, but for me, really, the décolletage is just sort of this area right, right in here. I'll show you. Let me minimize my screen here and enlarge that. So for me, the décolletage really is just about this area right, right in here, below the neck, between the shoulders, and above the breasts. Now, when you're featuring the décolletage, I think it's best the subject wear a garment that kind of outlines that area. And what that does is it draws focus to the upper chest area, but it also covers up uh, the non-décolletage area as well. Now, any type of uh, low-cut slip or onesie or bra will sort of automatically do that. Now, a bra will expose the bare shoulders, but um, I have a client here that had on uh, right here, she had on a, a sort of onesie that covered up her shoulders here, and it really features that area nicely right in there. I think this is more powerful than if the woman had was wearing nothing at all up top. And what the garment does is it, it differentiates between the area you want the viewer to focus on and not pay attention to the other area that is covered up. Okay, so what is the shot saying? The shot is saying to the viewer, I want you to look specifically right here. This is important. And you do that with Obviously, a close-up shot of the décolletage, how you frame your camera, how you frame your shot, outlining the area with a garment, but also by having that area in focus and anything in front of that area or behind that area out of focus. That is, that is very important as well. As in some of these shots right here. Now, as you can see here, this, the lower half of her face is out of focus, and this part right here is out of focus. This is probably shot with a 2.8 lens, so it's not really out of focus, but it is somewhat out of focus. Okay, so what is this shot saying? So like I mentioned before, the shot is saying, hey, I want you to look right here. That's what the shot is saying, <laughs> obviously. Now, what is the structure of the shot? The structure is very simple, really. Um, I usually grab a detailed shot of the décolletage when the client is on her back on the bed. And I do this at some point in the middle of a bed flow posing sequence or at the end. And it's really easy to either move in or zoom in and instruct your client um, what you're going to be doing next. Another aspect of the décolletage detail shot that I like to do, let me uh, get rid of these lines, is have the woman either with one finger, as in this shot here, or in this shot here, kind of take her, her middle finger and just sort of gently trace right across from left to right or from down and up, maybe just outlining the upper part of her breast very slowly. And while she's doing that action, I will take a series of shots. Click, click, click. And then you have some choice of what you think looks best. And I like adding the hand or both hands. It's a subtle way to sort of point to that area. And I also think it's just nice that the hand is in there. It's a, it's, it, I think it makes the shot look more interesting rather than just no hands at all. Here's some other examples. 
Now here, she's kind of, instead of this way, she's more like angled. And she probably started in the middle and just slowly drew them apart as I clicked. So the keys to the decolletage detail shot are, oh, I just noticed this bracelet right here, which I think is a nice little detail. Uh, the keys to the decolletage detail shot, like I mentioned before, is having a garment that will somewhat, you know, outline the area, having hands, fingers, or one finger subtly point to that area, and then also not including the face because you're saying that's not important right now, but I like including just the lower half, the lips and the mouth, and slightly parted is nice like, she's he like she has done here. I usually shoot it over the shoulder at this angle here. I like this angle more so than kind of more parallel to her. This is nice right here. You know, you're really saying, I want you to look just right there, including the hand. And of course the face is out of focus here. Some of the benefits the decolletage detail shot gives you is it gives you variety of mood. A lot of your other boudoir shots are gonna feature like two thirds of the, of the female, uh, maybe from you know mid thigh to the top of her head or head to toe or waist up. The detail shot is sort of taking a section of her form and you're really focusing on that part right there. You don't see her face, you don't see her lower body, and it gives you variety of mood and it gives you variety of composition. And that will really add to um, a good assortment and variety and collection of images that your client will want to have, you know. This is a great thing to add to your bed flow posing sequence, or even if she's standing against a wall or perhaps kneeling, just go in and grab some quick shots. Just tell her to trace her finger across or bottom from top very slowly. And this will be a great addition to your, to your session shots. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. Don't forget to like and subscribe this video if you want to see more of them. And I will see you at a future point in the YouTube universe.